it's time for another video this time on how to change the clicker setup in your fly reel from hard to soft and soft to hard and at the same time we'll also take how you will how you can change the retrieve direction from left to right um let's head over to my photo box right there because there you can see it much better okay let's go to change the retrieve direction from right to left and also change the clicker setup from soft to hard clicker setup um all you need is a screwdriver um you put your thumbs here on the logo to release the spool uh, make sure that you don't have your fingers over the black part because this one is coming out when you're pushing and then you just give it a gentle push like this and the center hub is released open the clicker cover there you go and inside you have two screws for the clicker guide and one screw for the clicker if you only want to change the retrieve direction from right to left you only have to take out these two screws take out the clicker guide and turn around and fasten it again and you you have changed the retrieve direction if you want to if you want to change the whole setup to hard clicker material so you got a little, even more breaking strength you will also have to um, change the clicker okay um, a really short detour here Bur just so I can show you how the whole system works when you have the the slider here in the lowest position with uh, the weakest breaking strength the slider here is all the way down so that the clicker can move freely inside this hole uh, breaking against this rubber ring inside um, so then when you move the clicker guide or the slider up the clicker guide will come out here a little bit and it will dampen the clicker so that the clicker can't move all the way to the side and will give stronger breaking power against this uh, this um, reel right here um, okay let's let's continue changing the retriever direction open these two screws here there you go two. and then i i usually use a screwdriver and just push a little bit here which will make the slider come out then i just turn around push carefully here there you go and the clicker guide is released it was it was uh, assembled this way so if you want to have it left uh, left retriever direction you just turn around like this put it inside again and fasten it with the screws if you also want to uh, change the clicker to to change to hard material you open this screw too um, and the clicker is released by just lifting it up here a little bit and then taking it out because it has a small cut right here so you can easily set it in i'm not going to change it to hard clicker setup now because i want i like the soft clicker setup best oops sorry 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 there you go so i'm just going to reassemble to my setup that i had before there you go in with a screw here. make always sure that you fasten the crew fasten the screws tightly so that you don't have any wobble in the clicker or the clicker guide i'm not going to change it to left-handed because i use right-handed retriever direction so here you go you put in the clicker the, the clicker guide like this and then from the other side you put in the slider again you see that the slider has a short and a long side make sure the short side is in the back of the um of this um hole here like this there you go like this and then just fasten the screws again um, 
really much easier if you take them out of this little um, here, but it works. There you go. And also these, make sure you tighten them really good and fast. Uh, tight because um, they are holding the slider from the other side. So if you don't, um, don't fasten them tightly, um, there will be some, some movement and wobbling in the clicker side slider. So always fasten your screws tightly. There you go. There's another pull. And there's a puddle up my pull. Then just assemble the clicker cover again. Um, slide it in here where the blue part is. Sorry, like this. And then you're good to tighten it. Okay, there you go. Um, to assemble the center hub into the into the frame again. Um, you see that you have a little dot right here and then you have a small dot also on the center hub right there and to some of them you you should make sure that these dots are pointing directly towards each other uh, before you give it a push and there you go ready to go now that your reel is all set up, left or right handed retriever direction, hard or soft clicker material, it's ready to be used. So head down to your waters and tight lines.